the Sullen Park Fire Department is looking for firefighters to join their forces after experiencing a significant shortage of personnel. Our very own Carla Draxler is live at the Sunland Park Fire Department to tell us all about it. Good morning, Carla. Good morning to you too, Trevor. Uh, I talked to the fire chief, Daniel Medrano, and he tells me that they have had a shortage of firefighters for the past few years, and they just want to make sure they're serving their community as best, best as they can. And uh, he also tells me, despite being so understaffed, they have managed to stay very, very efficient throughout the years. However, having more personnel would not only keep the efficiency, uh, but also take the workload off the firefighters that are now picking up on overtime shifts. He also explains the National Fire Protection Association's recommendation on the number of firefighters attacking a fire also does not align with the number of people the department has right now. Dwelling of approximately 1,500 square feet should have approximately 14 firefighters um, to attack that fire or, or to mitigate that, that type of incident. Um, as we have different size buildings, uh, strip malls, apartment complexes, warehouses, of course, those numbers will go up. Um, right now, the uh, my fire department has five personnel on duty 24 seven to serve the community. So you can see where those numbers, uh, we're not reaching that goal. Right now, the Sunland Park Fire Department is looking for applicants with these certifications to have at least Firefighter 1 and 2 hazmat operations and EMT operations to apply. And you can do so by uh, coming to the Sunland Park City Hall, dropping off your application. Uh, they are setting up as well a website that will be up and running soon. But the best thing to do right now, if you do want to apply, is to go to, go to the City Hall and do it in person. Reporting live from Sunland Park. I'm Carla Draxler. Back to you.